Maybe the stupidity will land now. Traveler, what's this? What can this humble monk help you with? By boat. The only problem is that most of them have sunk. I think once... T I help Brother Thorlo tend to the priory and keep order in our pursuit of knowledge. Though, I can't say I've done that job very well recently. What do you mean? There used to be another prior here, Brother Vernon. While we wanted to research slowly and cautiously, he wanted to rush through using whatever magical items we obtained without restraint. On top of that, he wished to learn anything he could about magic, regardless of its source. His worst vice was that of necromancy. His ways finally caught with him, and he accident. We expelled him immediately from the monarch. We sent him on his way, letting him grab only a few things from his... We are all convinced that Brother Vernon had some sort of a lair or ref. It's probably a place where he hid things and conducted a lot of his unorthodox research. But we have been unable to find it. Really? You would do that for us? You can ask around if you have to. Some of the other priors may know something of use. Please, bring me anything of interest that you find. Talk. Staying safe? We aren't really sure. Its location would obviously suggest that the Dwemer people built it. But there is little evidence to prove it. We've seen no signs of this kind of technology in other Dwemer ruins. So we can't do much beyond speculate. The skulls in Vizemonstadt were potentially studied. But none of the research made it out. So we'd have to start from scratch. Due to the continuous conflict in the land, researching the portal further simply hasn't been something we focused on yet. Perhaps someday, though. Interesting. Not really. I know that a growing problem in our over Falska, but uh, nothing else. That couldn't be. Unless. Ingvar is trying to start another war. Regardless. We cannot help. 700 years ago, Shore saved our ancestors so that we could flourish in this land and absorb its knowledge, not tear it apart with war. We will not help instigate another one with the Orvaldos. Of course, we are so loyal to the Borvaldos. If it comes to it, we will fight by Kigagnar's side until victory or Sovngor takes us. Hmm. Missing Skyrim. He still runs a boat to Skyrim. Speak with him. I'm sure he'd be willing to take you there. Okay, thank you for the knowledge. So you will not fight, only if forced. Hmm. 
So you will only act if the war starts. And you will do no preventive action in order to stop the start of the war. You're not, do you're not doing your job, monk. You're not doing your job as a deity or an emissary of peace. I'm very disappointed. Yes? He usually spent time around a pond during the day. I'd assume wherever he hid, it would be easy accessible. He was not a man of patience. Hmm? May the nine guide you. Hello. Well, he liked to go for walks at night. I'm not really sure when he found the time to sleep. Sure seemed odd at the time. Be careful out there. Oh, the other two are dead. Time to resurrect them. Love the pond. Walks at night. Sounds really, really fishy to me. Time to resurrect. Good. I'm afraid not. He liked to test out various magics, so wherever it was, it would be somewhere that we couldn't hear his trials. I have to go. Wherever it was, I doubt it was inside of the Priory. They aren't any good places. He would want plenty of space to try things. Be safe. Should probably set the set time scale four. Set time scale two four. This should help me a lot. So I won't have frame rate issues. Now let's inspect the pond. He loved this pond, correct? He also enjoyed to take walks at night hmm sounds like a job for detect life right I have been searching blindly but apparently I went just a bit too far. The hidden entrance is here. Surprisingly, he never left. He never left. The hidden entrance is somewhere around here. Here, look, he never left. Interesting notes. So I'm going to step into the Adric realm once again. Hmm.
mind control, that's quite dangerous. <laughs>